We're recording. What just happened? All right, folks, my name is Brian Holthaus. I make videos from the outdoors. If this is your first time watching one of my videos, smash that like button. And today we're spearing pike. And what is your favorite colored lure for spearing pike as a fake decoy? Drop it down in the comment section below. Let's go. They're not doing their coming. Oh, in. My bad. oh, you're fine. Get him. Bring him up. Get him out of the hole on your side. Oh. Nice toss, big oh, ticket. Man. Nice. That is awesome. You ready? Yep. Oh, but the local DNR for that one. Whoa! Rocky! Ooh. Nice toss, Vince. He got off. Are you serious? Yep. How? Oh, yeah, he took off. Did I hit him? I don't. couldn't have. I've never heard of. Pike, get off that spear. Let's see that face of disappointment. When you suck, you suck. Man. I hit that pike. Well, it's on. It's on? Yep. Didn't miss that. I've never heard of Pike, get off that spear. I've never heard of Pike, get off that spear. How about new? You have had one get off. Ready? Yep, nice toss, buddy. Got him in the middle of him. Here we go. Chew. Good throw, Vince. Two in the ground. And we get ours. Yeah. Yeah. Job. Whenever you're ready, buddy. Little boy. Another center shot. Dude, you're on fire today, man. Woo! Gotta put on my hat for the camera. There we go, man. How'd it go? Another one bites the dust. <laughs> nice toss, man. <laughs> He's, he's coming in. Do you want me to jig it a little? That's what I'm almost. I don't want to smoke him yet. I feel like every time I do that, do you? Just spooked him. No. That's what I mean. Like every time I touch it. I'm sorry, dude. No, it's not you. I mean, he was turning away. Whenever you're ready, buddy. Nice toss, Tones. Yeah. Easy. <laughs> oh, he's got it, dude. In his mouth. Just, hey, don't scratch my new decoy, dude. I'm gonna jig it. You're gonna spear him. Oh, shoot, he might be gone, dude. Yeah, that, you might have realized it's not Dang it. real. Whenever you're ready. Ah! 
We're good. Pull it up slow. Just chill. Just chill. <laughs> Just breathe. We're good. Just chill. Just chill. Bring it up out of the hole. Bring the weeds up. I'm going to have to scoop them out of there. Whenever you're ready, go. Pull them up out of the hole. Nope. Dylan! Hey. Nice pike, man. Heck yeah. Good job, man. Yeah, buddy! All right. Let's get them unwrapped here. Let me get this out. Hold on now. There she is. Hold on now. That's pretty sweet, man. Got it on film. I'm gonna... Guys and gals, one tip to take with you is if that pike swims in at a good pace and it comes into your live decoy, pull that string up with the live decoy on it slowly and that pike that came in will slowly come up with it. And that'll give you time to grab your spear and throw it through that pike. I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. So in this clip, this pike came in swimming at a decent pace towards this live sucker and I actually pulled the sucker up slow, and as you can see, it's already at the top of the hole of the sucker, and this pike keeps coming up. Whenever you're ready, and go. gives us a great shot. And we got it on our first hole, as you can see. Another tip is, if that pike comes roaring in super fast, just grab that live decoy and pull it up fast. And a lot of times that pike will actually circle around in the hole and be centered up, staring at that live decoy if you pull it up. And then you can grab your spear and spear it. I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. All right, folks, and as you can see, and this pike is just starting to swim in slow and I can actually see him and right away I grab the line with one hand and I pull it up right there. I pull it out of his mouth and the pike swings around and centered up and then my other hand I threw the spear. So I'll give you a top angle right now too. Here's that top view and he swims in. I pull the sucker away from him and throw the spear. Boom. Got him baby. Got him. Real quick, there's three different types of spearing decoys I take out with me every time I go spearing. And the first one is a red and white fish shaped spearing decoy. And when you jig it, it darts around just like a fish. And red and white has been an absolute confidence color for me spearing. It has worked time and time again. And secondly, I like to use a fire tiger colored spearing decoy. And it's the same shape as that first one, that fish shaped, and it just darts around just like a fish and it's a different look for them for them fish and um, if they're skittish on the edges of the holes or uh, they uh, you know they just won't come in try that different color that fire tiger and thirdly I use a northern crack spearing teaser and it's a golf ball and it's just got a little daredevil on the bottom and what that's gonna do is it's a different look than that fish shaped spearing decoy and it's really flashy and a lot of fish will actually come in and actually try to grab it right away so just you got to be a little more ready and uh, you know obviously tie up with braid or like a steel leader especially using that lure um, but fourthly if you're in a high pressure lake where a lot of people are spearing go and buy a live sucker minnow like a big sucker minnow and put that down because even if pike have seen a ton of different fake spearing lures it is really hard for pike not to come into that live one so use these tips the next time you're out spearing Whenever you're ready, buddy. Wow, I got him in the butt. I think that's what you were trying to do, bro. Nice, dude. Nice, Got dude. him. <laughs> Guys and gals, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, stop and do it right now, today, because you are not gonna wanna miss these next few videos I have coming from the outdoors ice fishing. They are absolutely incredible. Boom!